Currently in that spot, has no clue what's going on. Hype gets two kills, oh man, it's flying, that is insane! Nuki goes up for a double kill of his own when the players were pushing through the old wall being on the debuff. Huge kills, oh wow! Nuki just got distracted by his own teammate and pays the price because the timing was very unlucky. Hype looks to build more hype. He got that double kill already. It's two versus three. Hoodie is the last man standing. He gets the kill on Cider though. That smoke was a little bit too small. But he's being tired. He still has one flash, but he gets spanned through the smoke. Just play slow. Look, Nuki just goes in, but... An unfortunate timing for Lucker and Nuki just eats him alive. Huh? And with the Viper Spit. And this is easy to read. But Mixwell tries to be aggressive. Will that. We will not do anything, but. Okay! Mixwell with two kills for zero, I guess? A little bit of uh, luck loss. It seems like Hype gets the headshot, but Nuki gets the spray down on one. This is still an advantage for the attackers. 4v4 in such a map. Now slow down, pause it, Alliance, take your time, you can re-aggress, you can just try to make it a full push, but what a hole! Didn't pop the smoke, he goes for it now, he doesn't get the kill, and that's it, round done and dusted. Corner. Retake with the Cosmic Divide, ult from G2 for that retake as well, what a combo, but Mixwell is getting flashed by his own teammate, but they're on site, no one is here. They can start defusing without Alliance knowing that they're starting to defuse. What is the plan, Alliance? What is the plan, Alliance? I know exactly. And they just go in, they get the defuser. It's two versus three, and that's it. What a chaotic round. Well. First, blue methodical and just slowly grab the space. Doesn't work because G2 is not biting much and Meadow just gets kills for free. So it seems like one play is known to be in spawn. Lucker just goes in, but no luck for Lucker this time. It's splanted. But all players are hidden in tower, and now one flash just flashes three people. That's a lot of AC is done. Snake bite ready in the hand, but I mean the time is running out. This is actually a little bit slow on G2 side. Zeke even gets one kill on Mixwell. Fewer of a second. This is not looking good. Suddenly, second snake bite buys a lot more time. What? There's no way that Alliance wins this round. There is no way. One for one. Alliance looking good. They used the ultimate from Breach, but there's no follow-up yet because no one is fast enough to go for it. There's Lucker with the shorty. Goes aggressive. Not much space being like done by it, but a Volva is now being dead and that space being created. Viper spit to secure the spout and now it's an almost unwinnable scenario for G2 unless... Unless Nuki was meant to do that flank, but it's all going down the drain. The map still stays the same, but it's a 4v4, so... It's gonna be a... Hype again lurking, but this time a little bit of initiation on him, unexpected, but then he gets traded. Still, what? Well, it's, it's a little... Avova with this stand, he's badly needed to be safe now. It's a 3 versus 3, they have the breach ult. This is actually still holdable, and the Lacker just gets for free because they peek before the ult? I am how you want to play. It's very open to interpretation, and I don't think it favors a specific um, a specific side on a professional level. Maybe a little bit to the attackers, but now Maxwell is in a absolutely awkward spot. It's a miracle he's alive, but he whips all, whips all the knives and get then gets killed. Cider and Lucker gets two kills. Zeke is done, and not the one from Ascend, by the way. That guy is still alive, probably in a different game right now. 
and a 2v3 retake. Meadow and Nuki with like 5 HP. That's, that's gonna be pretty hard to do. And hype is... I don't... There's the R. Oh, lovely. So this is this is the way. Maybe not. Aftershock not getting much, but Meadow is able to get a little bit of space with that attack as well. Wait. Spike down B. Alliance is using a wall that is being used for attackers. What? What the hell? I am very confused. This wall. This. This wall is an attacker's wall. This is not for defense. I I'm very confused right now. Two versus three retake breaches on one HP. Or maybe two. Mix was in the in the such an awkward spot. And he's gonna get pushed from the other side, but he gets the drop on sequels to that on the two HP. But the metal is now alone in a good position to get the isolation, but he doesn't get this is so easy to read for Alliance. They know that it's gonna be happening from drop. And they have that hold. Mixwell without that smoke, as I mentioned. This is not... This is not what we wanted to see. Alliance just gets kills for zero effort. Mixwell just goes straight into his own death while being stunned. Above with the drop on the flank. Rope. And Hype is reading that. He gets that position. Gets the... A headshot of us at 34 HP, one body still, and the traps not being moved. So they know about this being controlled. This is such a smart setup from Alliance right now. And G2 can't really do anything about it, but Noki gets the kill. But he's on 21 HP. There are no heals available. 4v4. This is slightly favoring G2. He has an easy kill on, on Noki there. But Maxwell dies to Lucky that was unknown factor before they didn't know about the judge hoodie just stands out in the open the corner hiding but loki the hoodie sorry but loki just gets another one what loki just straight out wins the dash anymore lucker go lets them go on sites 10 seconds left there's the aftershock to stop the plant and there's the showstopper to stop it again oh no this is disaster this is disaster! Well played by Alliance! What a round! And it's lost! G2 just griefed themselves by disrespecting the utility that was still available to Alliance! After doing that. No! They just don't do anything! Hype unfortunately goes for that ultimate when he had the... When it was needed for a gun in that moment. So this is actually now in the favor of G2. Seems like a round secured unless Lucker can say no! And he says the first letter of that word. So it's only one left? Now that makes no sense. There are three players alive, so. There's the retake ultimate. It doesn't tag the other Viper. And Noki just gets one while I vote a bit. And it's happening! It's happening! Oh no! They didn't get the first kill. They actually got it! But now Noki, can he kill two? He gets two, but they kill three with classics! No way! Mix was standing out in the open like a lamp to a slaughter! Avova, can you do it? Can you do it? He gets one. 40 seconds, but this spike is at, at this. He needs to fake himself. And nothing can so far use the smokes to go through it, but now it's in a DK zone. He is at half HP already. He heard one player. He gets the vision on the second, but he doesn't shoot and Zyder takes him. And this is so if you pay attention what has happened this this round. This round is, you know, you can see oh like those three Frankers are getting three kills. But the reason why they're allowed to get three kills over A strong push into tower, but doesn't get much because of the utility being used. And Lucker just gets the post-mortem kill with a uh, boombot. I guess that's how you get a kill, even though you're dead. Second aftershock to clear a little bit of space on tower. Uh, but very smart, very smart play by Alliance to retake that space. Sater's still on side. He gets a drop. He dead. So unaware that he's still there. And he's still a force to be reckoned with. He doesn't peek over, uh, over time because he knows that he's a crucial part of the pressure. So he waits for the other players to just go through. Nuki holds the Cosmic Divide. Firot, can he be the Viper difference here? 
and he is the Viper Difference. Fjord goes in from B long. He takes a space. Cider's still alive. He goes for a defuse. Gets the half. Fjord is still alive. Not anymore, but he gets the half. And Cider needs to get that half. And he gets no way. No way that Cider gets this. The Toxic Up, I don't think, was used yet. Physical just goes in. But Cider just, just goes through. Kills a Volvo while. They were an advantage towards the D2, and now it's a huge advantage. G Hoodie gets the kill on the Sky. The Sky Div is going in play. 3 versus 4 retake. Spike not yet in. Hype now knows that two players in elbow. He gets the first jump peek. But Fjord just stands his ground because he was expecting players to peek. But he only gets one. It's still 2v3. Lucky gets the drop. One. Wait. What? What just happened? How is Mixwell alone? I, I blinked! And now it's also being known! The bomber is behind him! He's being tagged! He's being broken in pieces! By the bombot! Don't take the advantage of that gravity well. A little bit awkward because that could have gotten them the kill. The info gets two players. Are they trying to push? They're getting denied by that flash. The Brimstone Molly is not the best. Fear is still alive, no, never mind. Slow push by Nuki for long right now. He uses the arrow. He's being known. That flash might be deadly, but Nuki is just straight up better. Sider dies. For the defense. Hoodie goes for an aggressive push, but Maxwell goes with the showstopper. First blood by Maxwell. He gets them in the back while they're being busy with the player on long. Very well played by G2. That push. Through hookah was instrumental to the success of this round, but it's still not done. Two versus four retaking. We have seen weird. Beautiful shot on Mixwell. Straight up ignores the arrow. They know that the two players now on B long. That double hold from Melanuki. Very strong. But somehow Lucker gets one, doesn't die. Lucker is being spotted by the orb. Zico's aggressive, but Hoodie just gets the kill. Fjord gets the trade, but it's still 3 versus 3. This is a huge advantage. The, the Viper Spit to secure that. Spike is getting pushed by the older utility, but Noki was affected by the deep of it. Now it's being spotted. Essentially dismantled by two bullets. Two versus two. Viper Spit is being used. Wait, what? One enemy Last player Why? Standing. Oh my. Spike Did he think that they didn't take the spike here? I think so. I think. Uh, I, I was certain that he just used the Viper Spit because he was not certain if the spike was being taken or not. But Hoodie just clings out this space. There's no way he survives this, right? He goes for the ult. They go into two, left, right. That's gonna be it. He goes for the spam with the with the flashes. He goes out. Mixwell and... Lucker answers with that operator shot. Gets a tag. The Sova drone tags a player. And now that player has to abandon his position. But Firo... Spike planted. Well, he gets one. Hoodie, unfortunately, is being stopped. The legend. Wow. Good control from Hype. On Haven. Ah, yeah. oh, okay. My god. This is... I... Literally... That Boombot. This is not a good lineup for that smoke. And this is so smart. This is so smart by Seder. That position to outplay the Boombot in the smoke was just so smart. And unfortunately, Mixwell was... Un Two versus four. This time, G2 is not looking good and knocks into the smoke straight up. If he wins this run, this is going to be the craziest run. Never mind. Players are being known coming from Garden, and no one is in the hookah. Good headshot. Meadow gets taken down, but Avova while running kisses his opponent straight up with the Phantom into his forehead and gets the kill. Still, 4 versus 3. Not looking good for G2, but they have the side control. But somehow, 
Feared gets the headshot from a Vandal on his opponent, and Nuki is on 10 HP because he has one satchel to follow it up. After that pain shield, he gets some informations. He gets the kill. What a nice satchel to get himself quite fast on his legs up. What I'm talking about, dude. That this is where the smoke stops them a little bit, but allows the allows the pop flash to happen. But Mixwell will just die straight up through the smoke. Feared goes for the for the arrow. Now people can be in elbow. They have. Still no plant, which is weird, but it is what it is. They got where they are. Well, definitely not on B side, right? Fjord now uses the Hunter's Fury to stop the plan. It's successful. Lacker goes in with the showstopper, but gets taken down from heaven. And now this is a problem. Time running out. Seder alone, already in lamps, while his teammate is still on short. But he gets the position. He's being debuffed. He takes his time to reload. He knows about the one player, he doesn't know about the second one. Oh, this is gonna be so tough, now they know where he is. He taps it again, he needs to get a half. If he doesn't get a half, it's gonna be so tough. But he goes for the spam instead, it's gonna be for a retake. Again? No way! Okay, if this would happen the third time, I would be just going nuts. But this time, Sider doesn't get a kill, even though he avoided the boom for the third time. Him do an ace uh, and, and breeze in the previous match. Can he do it? No. Kuri <laughs> gets the jump peak, gets the info. Just goes in for the peak. The shock that deals damage to himself as well. He cannot go in because of that. Because of that flash and the stop on the stun. Spike planted. I don't know. What did he walk out of Huka? I think he did, right? Who's Lacker just going out of Fuka? Avova gets a kill on Hype. In the meantime, it's a free equalizer. Free on free. Zeke still holding Huka. Gets one kill while being on 5 HP. 1 versus 2. Avova, can you do it? Can you get 3 kills, 4 kills in this round to secure the round? Or just straight up defuse it? Because he's holding it. He's holding it. He's holding it. He gets another one. He gets the half. It's too far away. But 10 HP. Can he do it? He gets the tag. One shock to being gone. No way! He's not, not holding it! He has it! No way that Avova holds it! He has it! He has it! Snakebite covers CT. Noki gets the first on Locker. Then he gets the isolated kill on Hype. They just go run by 1-1. One, one. <laughs> run 1 by 1. And they get... At some point, that kill. But it's not looking good. They forced themselves into this round. And it's a 4v3 retake. Zeke gets one, but Meadow and Wix will just drop down from Hookah. And Ferrod... Ferrod has... A possible... Round to win? But that body block from Avova... <laughs> Sorry, I had to sneeze. I had to do it off camera. Mixwell with the opener on Seder. That's a very, very strong push. And now he's gonna go for another one. And he gets not he gets one, but hype gets a double because they lined up and suddenly it's not looking great. That aggressive push by Mixwell with Hoodie isn't paying off. Obscuring vision. But Avova! Man! This guy can be in city right now. They didn't hear anyone go through. But Avova now stops the plan, doesn't stop the plan because the guy just ignores straight up and Fiord gets a Gets fed a kill! Because the other player can be in heaven. Very smart. Nuki, no utility. 30 seconds to an hour. That's at the end of the round already. Time is running out. That's the Hunter's Fury. He gets both. It's defused! It's defused! No way! It was like 10 20 seconds or something like that! He gets it anyway! Mad or the madman! What is this round? What are those rounds, bro? Clutches are unreal on bind. Avova, Meadow, Hoodie, all stepping up when they're needed. Surely they cannot lose this, right? Lucky gets a kill on Mixwell. And in the meantime, there's a trade with two players in Long and two players in the Hookah. Lucky goes in half HP on that showstopper, can be killed with two bullets for a Vandal. He goes straight up! Well, it was a double kill. Unfortunate for him that he killed himself, but it is worth it. 
planted. Zeke was a little bit exposed, but good timing on that conversion to hookah. Conversion? No. Well, actually, Meadow goes for the lockdown and a 2v3 retake? Okay, now it makes sense. Avova, can you clutch it again? You're a god. You're a god if you can. You're a an absolute god if you can. He gets it! No way! What? What are those rounds? What am I witnessing, man? What? Guys, remember what I, t what I said about Locker? Trying to get the info in the first seconds on mid and he pays the price. He gets the one kill, but he doesn't get away. And now G2 has the advantage. But Noki dies. Zeke just gets fantastic kill because Noki was uh, essentially zoned out by the Nano Swarm. But Avova gets a kill on Firod while he was killed like this. 3 versus 2 retake, but Zeke is a little bit of a zealous. He doesn't wait for his teammate. He botched the dagger. Well, at least he knows he doesn't, no one is close. <laughs> so that's something. Hoodie gets a kill inside, isolated, why? Okay, Hoodie gets another one, he gets two, can he get the free? He gets the tap and the, the, and the leg and he leaves Zeke on 198. Um, G2 didn't have a control of anything here outside of B. Fortunately, no one pushed from Alliance. But now Zeke can play for, for the turret, he gets one kill. That wall from Hoodie saves their lives. He gets some damage done. Mixo is on 10 HP, he gets the heal. Nuki got a half HP left, maybe 50, actually 55. 10 seconds on that plant. G2 is playing with fire, they don't know about the second one. And now, this is the test. Will they do any damage? Disaster! Mixwell and Meadow die to the spot. Now the first blood also goes to G2, so this is a good opener. Kill loses... Like, uh, but again, uh, that's what I mentioned before, but... Okay, but Locker just gets one kill for, for zero effort. I don't know, this game is so weird right now, I, I cannot grasp it. It's overpeaking from both teams with, with no trades. Or and... Oof. It's gonna be tough for, for a lot scenario, but at least they have three, three guns, and Lucker just gets an insane kill. What a nasty shot. Now Ko gives some value. He uses that dagger to to essentially counter the drone. See, Lucker just goes in, gets another tag, gets... And they are suppressed. We don't know the position of the third, but now, Killjoy, again, hype was off. In a corner, and he's getting singled out. One Cider stopping the plan. 30 seconds. Only Mixwell alive. Can he do it? He has still his left. dash, by the way. But now he's being singled out. He's out in the open. His dash is out. Doesn't have the time to reload. Picks up the gun. He's being tagged again. He didn't use the smoke to cover the recon arrow, but he does it now for the A main. Five bullets left. He has the spike. He's being spotted. Half HP. 10 seconds left. Oh, that's it. Of that wall, so it's, it it won't be. Mixwell dashes in towards switch, closes the doors, waits for the rest of the team now to progress. There's a tag on Killjoy. No, there's no tag, but Mixwell still gets no. There was the tag. Mixwell gets two kills. Nice flank from the stairs after getting that drone tag. Side is clear. Five vs three, and it seems like on it, what they wanted to do, right? They 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 pushed on A with on A, which only made certain. Um, only G2 made certain to push for B, because there are only two players on the side. Okay. That was very, very well done, but unfortunately, they lost two players now, but they saved the op to the angle, this time with the Bucky, which makes sense. Lacker gets a kill from mid when he just peeks up. Hype doesn't get anything now, but... Ferret still still gets a lot of tags and the time is running out. Hey, wait, it's 15 seconds left. Guys, 10 seconds left. This has to be a push towards A. Cider, you play passively. You stop the plant from happening. You win this round, right? Six seconds left. That's it! It's lost! No time! That means everyone will be going through A. 
everyone will be going through A main. Mixed with us a lurker operated jet dies on pizza. And now that just gives certainty for Alliance that everyone is going through A main. The full retake is gonna go. They know there are four players there. 10 seconds left. The plant is there. Two players just pushing. Yikes! Easily read when when that wall is being heard, they know that someone is in that window. So that's easy to kill, get kills. Cider gets one, Mixwell gets the trade. Three versus three. Hunter's Fury available to stop the plant. There's the Hunter's Fury to stop the plant. Gets the tag, doesn't get the kill, but Mixwell unfortunately overstepping the stairs. Two versus two retake. Avova on market was the crucial piece of the puzzle to equalize the score. But he repositions. <laughs> what a shot by Firat! No, that's nuts! How do you get this one? Oh my god! An ace to keep his team alive. Alliance got an aggressive peak. Vova gets taken down, but there's the trade. There's the mix with the first kill. That's the mix with the second kill, but he runs out of daggers now after the right click. That's the trade. There's the rest suddenly looking winnable for G2. 3 versus 4. The full force is there. Someone is still on the top of the side. Lager gets taken down as a trade. Still an advantage for G2. But Hype, can he equalize? Can he get advantage? He gets 2! Insane! 1v1. I've barely. But the second one. No, that's a recon arrow. Checks the spam. White swing from Ferret! He has fear in his name, but he is gonna be. We're gonna see the same setup right now that G2 failed to dismantle before. Lacquer just goes in. Alliance was just gonna play retake on A. <laughs> well, bind button. <laughs> but he gets one. He still stops the push. He almost gets the second. 18 seconds left. The turret is active. There's the killjoy lockdown. How do you plant now? You have no time, G2. Why is this happening over and over again? This is something that G2 needs. If they want to be kept in this round, that's the round and Mixwell gets an insane double kill but gets traded by the turret. Tommy the turret gets a kill. Last player standing. Still, a nice round. I mean, this is still winnable, man. I have seen worse. Okay, <laughs> not when someone holds an angle. Nano zoom for market, nano zoom for CT. Drone is gonna check lane. They go in through a one way. Mando just gets a freebie. He gets tagged by the drones. Surely he gets tagged through the wall. Look, he gets a kill through the smoke because that was a trap. But Lucker gets double. Two versus three. Suddenly, Alliance is on the losing ground. Three versus two retake. I don't think G2 can retrieve any better guns unless... Wait, there are two, pl two guns lying just outside of B main. Those guns are retrievable. And now they're gonna have three rifles. And this is gonna be a disaster. Both players are playing in the backside B. They are being pulled. Can they get isolated 1v1s? Somehow one this first is done. The second one's not done. Still a debuff. Being active, but not enough anymore. Lucky goes in! Avova rescues them with a spectre! My reason why they lost the previous attack on B side for main. So they go in. There's the dagger, but there's the isolated entry. And metal just gets a freebie. 4v4. Plant is gonna happen. KO is gonna have that plant easily for sure, but he's just a little bit late. Mixwell with the daggers ready. He's waiting for the drone to get the first information. The doors are still not destroyed. Zeke is being tagged. No, he's not being tagged. He gets a kill, but the Mixwell gets the trade. Three versus three. Not much utility being used. Two versus two. Noki gets the first one, gets the second. No! Just the headshot, 5 HP left! Can he get the tap? Ah, oh, surely not! Avova again clashes it out for his team and keeps the dream alive! Will he get the trap? He did get the trap. There's the Zeke ult with the KO that goes through. Mix will get spammed. Oh my god, what amount of utility is nuts, but Meadow still gets one before dying! 
Noki gets another one. Laka just goes in, misses all the shots. What is this chaotic round? Zeke gets the trade on on Hoodie and rescues Laka. They didn't go on side because they know there's still two players there. Now they re-aggress towards A. Avova is being spotted. Mix was being spotted as well. He made some steps before going there. So now that no fear left. has no has knowledge about two players. He knows about the third one. He gets it a freebie. He knows about two players now being on heaven. Mix will gets a freebie as well. This was unfortunate. Now it's a two versus two. Mixwell swaps the gun. Full utility for Mixwell in a possible situation. What is going on? He can dash on side into a smoke. Get the first angle isolated. Avova has to trade him. This is gonna be tough. Still can he use the smokes, but he just lets... He just... What? We have seen this uh, be a disaster in the past, but Lucker has a very good position to help his teammate to plant. But now, he needs to go back at some point. This is the moment when, he go when he's going back. Five players in A main. Five players in A main. This is... This might be going... Either way, this is gonna be tough, but the Bova gets tagged by the Recon Arrow, no one shoots the Recon Arrow, bro, what is going on? Not this Fury, KO used the ultimate as well. What is going on? Mixwell gets the kill. Lacker just dash outside, gets, gets a double. The grenade from KO stops the defusal. Running out of time. Does he have it? 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 Yes! Yes! Now just pushes for B-side with the ultimate from KO, denying more utility being used by G2. So they just go on on side. But Mixwell has a good spot, but he is being destroyed by Lacker. Hoodie with an insane one tap gets a tag. A hype is getting killed by Nuki. Can he do it? Can Hoodie still hold that side like a fort? He's alone, but still alive. And he gets another one tap. What is Hoodie doing, man? He's just keeping G2 by its hair from drowning. He's still playing time. He still has this. Oh my god, dude, you're insane. That's absolutely bonkers. He gets another one. Yes. Hoodie just gets four out of the blue! Lucker with that kill! He is on 10 HP though! But Hoodie gets the equalizer on Ferret! Remember guys what I said at the beginning of the game, right? Ferret is always on top mid! And he's being deleted because of that! Hype with the kill on Meadow! This is nuts! But this is a fake! And G2 is running towards that fake! They're being- this is being sold beautifully by Alliance! G2 is clueless in this moment! What is happening? We don't know! No one knows! And it's planted by Luckers! Overstayed is welcomed! Hoodie is known that he is being updrafted! I mean, sorry, boosted up! But there's Hype! He gets one! Last player standing. But he's now left alone, and there's no way that he can win this round. What a retake by G2. Oh, was that important? 11, suddenly this is looking insanely good for G2. This round is going to be very tough for Alliance to break into. And specifically also when they lose a Soba like this. What the hell did we just witness? If that was a double kill, that would have been absolutely insane. Man, it's still winnable for Alliance. It's a three versus three, but that spike is in a really bad spot and now it's being spotted. Oh no. Hype. What are you gonna do? And makes look at the kill on Locker. Oh, that's put his tat position of the spike. Did they hear Zeke before? I think they heard him when he was going through spawn. Avova is waiting for him and he gets that drop. Hype, can you make it work? 1v3. Surely not. He has a Guardian. We have seen crazier stuff to stuff today. But this the only way of winning this round is being aggressive. The only way of winning this round is being aggressive. He gets the first one. This is winnable. He knows about one player. The camera is not spotting him. He doesn't get the first one. No way! Hype! What is going on? No way! Opportunities of clashes like this and only it happens once and we witness it in the parallel universes in 30 million universes Hype loses!
You are divided! Lock in sight! No! <laughs>